Welcome. This video will show you how to insert marks into the UWI Open Campus new online system. There are three different methods of attaching marks to a student's record. Manually entering marks into a class list, uploading the marks from a Microsoft Excel spreadsheet, input your marks for a student by searching for their student ID. You are also able to modify marks already applied to the student record. Finally, you can view final grades using two methods, viewing final slash overall composite grade and percentage, printing of UWI summary mark sheets to submit to the exam section. We strongly recommend the use of Internet Explorer to insert marks into the new system. Navigate to open.uwi.edu and click on the My OC link at the top of the page. Input your staff credentials and log in under Banner XE. Click on the Faculty Grade Entry link. This will load the interface. Manually entering grades. Once Faculty Grade Entry interface loads, click on the Grade Book tab. You will see all course sections you are responsible for. All course coordinators, e-tutors, second examiners, etc. are assigned to the course sections, but only the course coordinator will have the authority to enter or edit marks. All other assignees will only be able to view these marks and grades. All of the columns can be sorted in ascending or descending order based on your preference and can also be shifted from left to right by dragging and dropping. If you do not see the courses assigned to you, please contact APAD and they will assign it to you accordingly. Click on the course you would like to load marks for, then click the components button. Your course may be broken down into one or more components. If your components weight have been built incorrectly, please contact Assessment Awards Records Department immediately to rectify this issue. Once resolved, then load your marks. Click on the required component to input the marks. You will notice the system loads in your entire class list. Input the marks for the student and click save when finished. The system will automatically compute the final percentage and apply a grade. Two minor things to note. Number one, notice that you do not need to alter the grade change reason field as this field is only changed if you need to change the grade already entered for the student. Number two, Notice the rolled field. This field indicates if the grades were officially published to the student record. If it is blank, then you are allowed to make changes to the student grade. If it is ticked, the grade field is not editable, then no changes can be made by you to the student record as the information has been officially published to the student record. Note, if a mark is unavailable for a student, please leave the score field blank. If a student was field absent or has a medical for this course, this will be updated administratively by Assessment Awards Records Department. Upload and grade form from Microsoft Excel spreadsheet. Inside Faculty Grade Entry, click on Grade Book tab and select the course you wish to upload the grade for. Click the Components button. Select the button you wish to input the grades for. Click on the Tools and export the grade template. Save the file to a known location on your computer. Open the Excel document and inside the score field, input the scores for the students. In the Grade Change Reason field, you can input the code that corresponds to the original entry, which is OE. Do not make any modifications to any of the other files and save. Go back to Faculty Grade Entry and click on Tools, Import. Select the location of the file on your computer that you have modified. You will now see an Import dialog box. Click on Next. The system runs a check on your imported file and checks off the field headers that passes verification. Click Import. The system will now begin to import and overwrite the records with the imported file. You will receive a confirmation prompt if the import was successful. Click Finish. A percentage and grade is automatically calculated. Search for a student record. Inside Faculty Grade Entry, navigate to the component that the student is listed in. In the search bar to the top of the grade entry area, type the student ID number or a name. All available matches are displayed in the grade entry area and you can modify the grade as needed. Be sure to select the correct grade change reason before saving. How to modify grades already applied to a student record. 
To modify a grade attached to a student record, you need to navigate to the course then select the correct component of course. This is either coursework or examination. Then scroll to the correct student and inside their score field, re-enter the correct mark. Then you must select the reason for the grade change. Click on the drop down arrow inside grade change reason field and select the correct reason why the change was made to this particular student. Note that you cannot change a student mark without indicating a grade reason. Click save and you will be prompted that the changes were applied to the student record. Viewing final slash overall composite grade and percentage. Inside faculty grade entry, click on gradebook tab and select the course you wish to review and the composite grades for. Click on the composite grade button. The final grade and percentage for each student inside the selected course is displayed here. This is for your information only. Printing of UWI Summary Mark Sheet to submit to the Assessment Awards Records Department exam section. The final mark sheet is required by the examination section. To generate this, go to the portal page and click on the Banner Production SSD link. Click the Faculty Services area, select the UWI examination mark sheet. Select the correct turn from the drop down box that you wish to generate for a grade sheet and submit. You will see all of your courses displayed here. Select the correct course and submit. A listing of students and their grades will be displayed. The bottom of the form will carry a signature area. You are required to print and sign this report in your correct area before submitting to the examination department. Notice the rolled field. This field indicates if the grades were officially published to the student record. If it is a N, then you can go back to the faculty grade entry and make changes to the student mark. If it is a Y, there are no changes to be made by you to the student record as the information has been published to the academic history. The UWI Open Campus, online, on-site, on-demand.